but I, we did have something that I uh, wanted to share with you, um, which uh, you never know. You, you might find this useful. So uh, take a look. Hey, everybody. I think you guys have all seen, and maybe some of you have had the opportunity to come down a rope on a rig like this. Yep. Uh, but today, I wanted to show you something that you might not have seen. And that is how we go up a rope. Because let's face it, just about anybody can go down a rope. It's kind of like controlled falling. To go down a rope, we need a one-way device. And what that device is going to do is it's going to let the rope slide through it easily in one direction, and then it's going to grab and not let the rope go in the other direction. And if we use a couple of these and a foot loop, uh, we can actually just hoist ourselves up the rope by just using the power in our legs to do it. So one piece of equipment I mentioned is this ascender. And this ascender will take a rope in it, and then you drop this gate, and now the rope goes through one way, slides easily, but then it grabs the other way, and then up, and then grabs. So the principle is pretty simple. So uh, you have an ascender uh, attached to your harness, and you also need, or it's easy in my case, I have an ascender, if you can see this, this is the same hardware. Uh, on my chest, this is called a chest pull. So to do this, what you do is you put the rope through here and drop the one-way device so it's locked. Put your weight on the rope, and now I'm hanging from my harness uh, on the one ascender. Now I've got another ascender here, which has this foot loop, and I just attach it to the rope as well. Slide it up. I've got the loop. Put my foot in here, I stand up, and as I stand up, this rope is going to travel through the chest crawl, and then I can just sit back down in the harness, and I'm on my way up the rope. It's as simple as that. I take this ascender that's here, I'll slide it up, I think that's a little out of the picture, and then stand up, sit back down, slide the ascender up, stand up, sit back down, and one more time, stand up, sit back down. That's it. That's how you send up a rope. Thank you. Uh, this thing's one way. Uh, I need to come down. Help! How did you come down? Um. He's still, I, I'm still there. He's, he's still up there, isn't he? Yeah, <laughs> I'm still there. Maybe I'll do a, 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 a another video on that later. It's uh, that that part is a little tricky, and y you can get killed. Um, you have to actually change your your rig while you're on the rope. So you might have noticed that uh, the first ascender that I showed you guys in that video was on a separate loop, a separate uh, carabiner. I didn't use that one to go up the rope. So the short story is that you use that uh, ascender and you transfer your load onto to that one. And then you have to de you have to take off the other ascenders and then you put uh, figure eight back on, which is that, that uh, friction device, that first black piece of metal that, that I was on when I stepped into the picture. And then you uh, go up the rope a little bit more and uh, unload the, uh, the last uh, ascender and take it off the line, and then you slide back down the rope. So that's a short story. But uh, anyway, that's, that's the, the answer to your, to your question. So We will be able to see Brad do this in person next year at the hotel. Oh, now here's a, here's a thing. That's true. There is a, 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 a deck on that, on that, uh, hmm, that's interesting. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> it's a good it's a good good high room as well you can go up it, quite a long way well i was thinking about just going off the side of the hotel oh flip yeah wow. i was gonna say i'm sure the hotel would be very happy about you climbing up the side of the building oh i would just go down it's a lot faster and i can just ditch my gear in the car and drive away before they you know okay. actually get there to cause the problem. yeah we'll have photographic evidence <laughs> yeah, that <laughs> that could be a problem. There's actually a a, a donate a, a not for profit group that uh, has events all over the the United States, and they set up on the side of buildings. And if you're a lunatic like me, and you would like to uh, rappel off the side of a building, just like in a in a James Bond movie, well, you can do that. And all of the donations go to child uh, cancer uh, research, so it, it's a it's a pretty good deal. Um, that will be the last time we're at that hotel. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> It'll exactly. be a great sight to see, though. Oh yeah, 